What does the nine hole par three course at Vitense Golf Land have in common with the South Course at the Firestone Country Club in Akron, Ohio? The course once redesigned by Robert Trent Jones and the current home of the Bridgestone Senior Players Championship. Well, Jerry Kelly walked off the final green at each course, the winner. Kelly grew up on Madison's west side. His parents, Jack and Lee Kelly, moved the family to Maple Bluff when Jerry was 12. He has a brother, Scott, and three sisters, Sue, Trisha, and Carrie. The entire family played sports, and since Jerry was the youngest, he learned a lot from his older siblings. Being the youngest, his mom would take him to the driving range with her in the summer when the other kids were old enough to be out of the house. Jerry was just a baby, but there he was at the driving range, probably squirming around in his baby seat, hoping to get out so he could work on his short game. One of his favorite memories was when he was six. He was interviewed for TV after winning the Channel 3 George Vitense Par 3 Tournament against seven and eight year olds. Kelly played hockey, baseball, and soccer as a youngster in addition to golf. That meant that when they moved from the west side of town to Maple Bluff, he was now playing against all of his old friends. Naturally, there were some very heated battles that took place. He only had one true sports idol growing up, a man by the name of Jack Nicholas. Jerry says his father gave him all the tools he needed to succeed at anything in life. Hockey was his favorite sport, but he was better at golf. Jerry says he could never see the ice the way he could see a green. He hung up the baseball glove when he was 13, a victim like so many of us of the curveball. He won 11 high school letters in golf, hockey, and soccer. A broken ankle as a freshman kept him from winning a 12th. He won all city honors in hockey and soccer. He made the inaugural all city golf team as a senior. He also played in national golf tournaments all summer and a handful in the winter. Jerry would always say that he would skip a hockey tournament for golf, but never miss a golf tournament for hockey. That's how he knew which path to follow in life. He took his game to the University of Hartford in Connecticut on a scholarship. Kelly did his part in helping the Hawks make four straight NCAA tournament appearances. He took medalist honors four times for the Hawks and ended his college career with 27 top 10 finishes. Before turning pro in 1989 after college, he won his first major amateur event in the Wisconsin Amateur Match Play Tournament. Jerry Kelly's game was on autopilot in 2002 when he won for the first time on the PGA Tour at the Sony Open in Hawaii. Later that season, he won the Advil Western Open at Cog Hill outside Chicago. Those two tournament victories helped him finish fourth on the PGA Tour money list in 2002. He got his third win in 2009 at the Zurich Classic in New Orleans with a two-foot putt for par on 18. In 2003, he was the 18th ranked player worldwide according to the official World Golf Ranking. Four years ago, he made his debut on the PGA Tour Champions Circuit. He's won eight tournaments since then, including the Bridgestone Seniors Championship mentioned earlier, the first major he's won in his professional career. And of course, we all remember his most recent win this past June here in his hometown at University Ridge in the American Family Insurance Championship. Kelly gives credit for the success he's had to coaches, friends, and family along his path, including his dad, Jack, Ray Geschke, George Fabian, and Rob Andringa. His brothers-in-law, Joe Gambardella and Pete Waite get credit for helping Jerry handle the pressure as he continues his career on the Pro Tour. Jerry and wife Carol have a son, Cooper. They enjoy family time, and now that his son is in college, Jerry says he and Carol feel like rookies again, traveling the world over to spend time with him. Regarding his induction tonight, Kelly smiles every time he realizes he's going into the same Hall of Fame so many of the people he grew up trying to emulate are in. In his own words, that's as cool as it gets. 
The Madison Sports Hall of Fame and Strand Associates Incorporated are honored to welcome Jerry Kelly into the class of 2021.